Hello and welcome to Dartmoor. Uh, you join me again with my good friend Mark. Hey. Uh, we're going for a wild camp up on just past White Hill. It's just below Cosden. Bit of a plateau up there. You might have seen it on the other video. Um, so yeah, just a wild camp out. Nothing major. But we um, should have a laugh though. It's all good, yeah. Unless it doesn't rain. But it shouldn't do. I can better not do. Because <laughs> we'll get wet. So yeah. So I'll give you a look around. There's Cosden, as you've seen it hundreds of times, with <gasps> Sharp Tour, isn't it? Is that Sharp Tour? Actually, I can't remember the name of it. Anyway, that tour over there. Uh, there's Bellston. Um, yeah, we're actually looking for the Bell Stone, because apparently there's a stone here, it looks like a bell. But we think it might be that one, but we're not sure. So anyway, so. Yes, there you go, that's what we're doing. So I'll bring you back in a bit. Here we are at the Horseshoe Ford. There you go, it's a bit deep this time, isn't it? It was a bit. A little bit. Yep, yeah, lucky we got boots and gaiters. Makes me laugh, you see people up here in trainers and shit, don't you? You <laughs> yeah. just see, shoes, you're gonna die. <laughs> Bob will come up here with fit flops, wouldn't he? Which ironically would be the best, and it's almost barefoot, which is almost better. Yeah. Because there's nothing more waterproof than your foot, apparently. True. But then again, tell it to the First World War soldiers who got trench foot. <laughs> I think they broke that myth. But as you can see, it's over there, it looks like it's going to hammer it down. Over there, it's quite nice. Yeah, so we're hoping that the Met Office got the weather forecast right. And, uh, well, no, I just don't want any thunder. Well, no, that wouldn't be good, would it? Do you know what I mean? Thunder's okay, it's lightning. Well, it's, it's the same thing, isn't it? No. Uh, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is actually, yeah. yeah. Thunder is the noise lightning makes yeah. when it hits the crack, when it breaks the air molecules, turns them into plasma. Yeah, it's the gap in the build up. Yeah. Bang, motherfucker. <laughs> yes, and I don't want to be sat on the wet floor with a metal pole next to my head. <laughs> But, yeah, there we go. It's like a second world war plane, doesn't it? It's just it's a storm plane. Seed in it. <laughs> so, yeah, anyway, we're heading up there. And we're going to get onto the plateau and find a pitch. So, here we are at our campsite. Um, you might recognise it, actually, from the... Um, Cosden Triple Row area. I was here with my little tarp. I was actually sat here. Um, at the time, I did think actually it would make a bloody good little campsite. So, so Mark's got his um, Mini Peak 2. That's a good little tent. It's a square version of mine, basically. Yeah. Um, he's got to pitch it out a bit more. Yeah, if you pitch. So I think these straps adjust, don't they? I think they pull in. Yes. You got ventilation both sides. Looks that way. Yeah. In posh. <laughs> oh, I see. Two vent man. Double vents. Double vents. Yes, so the weather's cleared up a bit, thank God. Uh, so there's Bellston, there's Winter Tour, East Mill, Yes Tour, High Will Hayes, West Mill, Oakey. Uh, so, yes. And of course, up there is Cosden. Yeah, all set up now. Here's me, here's my home for the night. My old faithful Hicks Peak. Got the bed set up and uh, yeah. It's Marky's home for the night. The this time. Yes. <laughs> and not completely knackered and wet. Yes, that didn't help. It doesn't look too bad though, that nest. It's a bit comfy. Yeah, it's just narrow. Yeah. What mat did you bring? Thermarest. Oh, you got your thermarest? 
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Which one is it? Uh, All oh, right. So, so like the bank one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it comfy? Why? Would it fit? It would fit, yeah. But um, because last time when I was, because I tend to like, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, you do. Apparently, the trick is I was reading about another thing I forget to do, meant to do and forget, is um, was it silicon? Just a few drips of silicon on it, and it yeah. creates a little bit of a grip. The biggest, the biggest trick is flat ground. Yeah, flat ground, <laughs> not on a slate. I actually think camp, a bit like that. I've got a feeling I'm on a bit of a slate there. I don't think it's too bad. I don't think it's as bad as Linstall. Yeah. Yeah, mine's like that. So I'm not quite sure which way you're supposed to get in and out. I put my head up this end. Yeah, I'll set it up the head that end. Yeah. Yeah. Because I find it easy to get out that way. Because you can get your feet out first. Yeah, you can sort of swing out and get out that way. Yes. Yeah, so here we are. Look at that. Not a bad view to have dinner with, is it? Apart from over there. It's a bit, mm. Over there's nice. The sun's going down. There's Marky having his chicken and noodles, noodles that disappeared. Yeah, they did. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a chicken curry with pilau rice. I just chucked it all in and as you do. Oh, look at that. Oh. Yeah, here's my tea. Um, that's the view I'm having. I think this is the last of the low cloud coming through, isn't it? By the looks of it. Apparently it's gonna be a clear night, Cindy said. Well, I'd like to see some stars and some shooting stars and stuff. Yeah, so we're gonna eat my tea, and if I see anything else, I'll bring you back. Oh, so it's now uh, what time is it? It's nine o'clock. Uh, stove on the go. Uh, I'll just make a hot chocolate for bed. Uh, it's a bit misty out there at the moment. But it's <laughs> yeah, I think I can get some more light. Oh, no, no, no. There we go. Uh, there's Marky in his tent. Uh, yes, yeah, so it's a bit misty. Uh, that's, uh, there we go. Just turn the lighter one. That's the one. That's right. oh, so, yeah. So, here's my bed for the night. I've got my sleeping bag over there. It's the Winter gears, I'm gonna Z, I'm Z flame. So, yeah, it's good down to minus six, so I should be all right tonight. If I get down to one or two tonight, then it should be all right. Oh, it's a bloody torch. It's got one of those things with a motion detector. I thought it'd be a good idea. It ain't. <laughs> it keeps going up. Keep going, oh, can't see. There you go. Uh, I've got my X bed. This is the uh, Sitma LU9M. Tall one, it makes this a bit. It can, you can end up touching this, but. I do like the extra height, it's nice. So yeah, so yeah, I've got my Tobin Road over there ready for the munchies. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna wait for me to make the hot chocolate. And uh, I'm gonna go to bed. I'll watch some telly on my phone. Yeah, it seems to be clear enough actually. It was a bit foggy, but it seems to be 
clearing a bit. So yes, so um, until tomorrow morning, good night. <laughs>